What up, G? I'm coming back at you with another YouTube video topic. Another YouTube video topic. Um, so I'm gonna start this off with a story. Um, December 2022, of course, December 2022 was a period in which I had stopped going to the gym. Now I'm a guy who trains every single day every single day now that i work an actual job maybe like five days out of the week which is still better for most people but college chike high school chike no life chike chike who had nothing else to do but work focus on his grades and work part-time i was in the it was, i was in the mud bro i was in another realm okay i was in hellheim putting in work in the gym every single day december 2022 August, September, October. This is, I'd say roughly three months into my career doing HVAC. I had stopped going. And, you know, I have this church and they cook a lot of food and I was just going there. All right. Because we had events around that time. And I was just too busy. I didn't think much of it. I was just too busy. And I was just eating, eating, and eating, and eating, and eating, and eating. And great, it was so good that I went from about 180 pounds to 195 pounds, all right? And I didn't notice until one day I went to the gym. I didn't think much of it. It took like maybe a week and a half off, all right? And I got back to the gym. And prior to that, I was hitting 225 on bench for about six reps. I kid you not, I put up 12 reps easy. Uh, 225 after that week and a half period of not working out just eating and just resting just eating and just resting so in this video i want to talk about overtraining overtraining are you overtraining how to avoid it i know i have another overtraining video but this one hopefully will be more in depth all right so let's get into it essentially overtraining is you're training too much to the point at which you're not actually building muscle and this may stump somebody, be like, what? How do you train to the degree that you don't build muscle? How is that even possible, Chica? That doesn't make any sense. If you train, you should build muscle. Actually, no, be quiet. That's not true. That's not true. Your muscles don't grow off of how much you train, but they grow based on how well they recover and how much they recover. Muscle growth isn't training and destroying your muscles and sending your muscles to Niflheim, all right? Training your muscles is actually, building your muscles and growing your muscles is actually how well they are recovering. How do your muscles recover? Sleep and nutrition. Sleep and nutrition. What was I getting within those week, within that week and a half? I was getting a lot of nutrition and I wasn't eating crap, okay? I was actually eating homemade, good, wholesome foods rice potatoes um curry uh chicken ribs beef whole ingredient foods basically whole ingredient foods all right i wouldn't eat no domino's pizza or no ding dongs or no donuts good nutrition and i was getting plenty of rest plenty of rest and what that allowed my muscles to do was to recover me having this unknowingly i mean i had no idea i thought i was just chilling i thought i was just being a bro Came back to the gym, put up 225. Right now, I'm currently in a state of rest again. I overtrained again. All right, and this has brought me to a realization that um, I need to change better habits about myself with my training. Because recently, I found that I was overtraining simply because maybe it's not that I was going to the gym not enough, but because I wasn't getting enough nutrition or rest. Okay, so what what the, the current situation that I'm in is I tried to put up the same weight once again, all right? And I couldn't hit 12, I hit less than that. And I thought, what's going on? Why am I getting weaker? Well, I looked at my, I stepped on the scale again. I'm back to about 180 pounds. So I lost 15 pounds, maybe not since December, but like over time and the fact that I lost that weight shows that I have been eating less. And 
what actually causes me to eat less, I'm just talking about myself personally, is that I'll go to work and I'll work and I won't take a lunch because I just be busy. That's just how I roll sometimes. Like, it's not even just me at work, maybe just me just doing my thing in life. I'm more focused on getting tasks done, like making YouTube videos, um, hitting the gym, going to work, taking care of my dog and doing other things. And I will forget to eat. And that's why in this video, I wanna express why it's actually really important to prioritize your recovery when you're training more than actually training itself more than training itself are you recovering properly how long does it take to recover a muscle group 24 to 72 hours i mean 48 to 72 hours two to three days per muscle group so let's say you hit buys on monday you want to wait till about thursday to hit buys again to see the optimal result maybe two days all right it's, it does kind of depend on your genetics a little bit depends on who you are as a person and also how you're sleeping and how you're eating all right if you're getting five hours of sleep every night and you in a, a handful of cashews and a black coffee from qt you're probably just not recovering all right it's nothing to do with your training okay you just eat like a marine that's your problem okay so focus on recovering your muscles more than you do actually training Okay, I came up with a time under tension video. Yes, train properly, train efficiently, all right? Send your muscles to Helheim, okay? Send them biceps to hell, all right? Put, put them through the crucible, sure, all right? Put them legs to the crucible, but after you do that, you gotta let them rest because obviously you can't just damage your muscles and then not allow it to get the proper proteins to repair your muscles. The muscle repair is what makes your muscles grow. It's not actually destroying your muscles. If you just destroy your muscles and they don't repair, then you didn't work out. You just injured yourself. That's all you did. You just injured yourself. You just injured your muscle fibers and they just chilling right there, just crusty. They're just getting crusty up, up, up under there. So fellas, don't overtrain. I am currently in a state of rest right now. I've made i've already kind of broken that i've already actually did a slight workout earlier today so shame on me shame on me but i'm taking a week off where i'm focusing on my nutrition focusing on my sleep focusing on recovery all right so that i can perform better when i get back well what what can or will i do stretches light cardio stuff like that but listen to your body sometimes you need to take a break all right, if you're freaking hungry, freaking eat. Unless you're trying to lose weight, then just learn to be hungry, all right? But essentially, listen to your body. Rest if you need to rest. Eat if you need to eat. Just eat the right foods, okay? Whole ingredient foods, guys. I know I say this a lot on my channel. Whole, in, whole ingredient foods. Don't say, oh, my body wants Skittles, so I'm gonna eat. That's not your body, bro. That's a demon. Kill it. <laughs> Kill that demon, bro. <laughs> Send that demon to Helheim, all right, guys? So... Anyway, I'm not gonna stress this video out too long. Um, if you like this video, if you found anything of value in this video, if anything about this video uh, stood out to you or you have any questions, put it down in the comment section below and help the algorithm. Help me out with the algorithm. I'm trying to blow up. Like my thing on video, subscribe, bro. All right, just subscribe. And if you're trying to become a better man, you wanna learn how to just get, get buff, I don't know, you want to build your testosterone, you want to be more comfortable with women, subscribe to my channel because not only am I on the same path, but I've already made considerable progress with my physique, with my confidence, with who I am as an individual. I'm not saying I'm the end all be all, all right guys? I'm not saying I'm the pinnacle of men. That's not what I'm saying. But I'm saying I have a lot of value in this field and I want to help you guys out. I want to help myself out and I want to build a community. So. If you're interested in being a part of my community that I'm building, it's really small right now. Uh, honestly, there's about two guys in there right now, but they're some kings. So go ahead and follow the Discord link down and below. All right, the Discord is down in the description of this video. You guys can go ahead and join in there and you'd be able to jump in a one-on-one -on -one call with me, ask me any questions that you have about you know fitness, maybe chicks, you just wanna talk, you know, whatever. I, it really don't make me no different. Just know I'm really busy, so you have to be serious, okay? 
anyway, that's it for the video, guys. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace out.